Bunch of hoodlums. Bunch of hoodlums is what they are. Oh god, fuck shit. Good midnight, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator who was woken up in the middle of the night, but I guess that's just fine. We'll get some stuff going. I see a fellow waiting down there. Maybe that's the guy that scared me awake. And I don't like that none too much. I've also, uh, seem to have quite a bit in my bag. Maybe I could stash this somewhere. But then the question is, 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 I'm, am I gonna remember it when I decide to leave Riverside? Probably yes. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? Thank you, Bubsy. Bubsy Wubsy! And I don't have a lot of room in here for, uh, for things. But I guess I can stash some stuff. Just a little bit of stuff. And I really want to keep these toys in my bag. That is what's most importantly. Uh, Majesco, we got some fishing net traps. I guess I could put the traps on the floor. As long as they are centered on the floor, then I shan't forget them. At least, uh, I hope not. Fairly heavy load. Why? Why, why, why? Hmm. Because we've got the axe, probably. Got a bunch of eggs. I was going to cook these eggs, but I didn't, and now they're going to go bad. So that's not good. I'll pro probably need that energy drink. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, we can build a door with these door hinges that I got. Really, it's cheaper to um, just make a window and put a sheet over it. But uh, zombies can't follow you through that, obviously. Not that they will most of the time, but they can, which I don't like. So I'm going to eat this MRE, see if we could just uh, get a little more weight off. I mean, I'm putting weight on because I'm eating a whole MRE that's like 1,200 calories or some shit. Because when you're in the field, you need to have energy, boys. That's right. Okay, so uh, I'm relatively underweight now. Since I put the axe away. Hey, buddy. How's it going, man? How you doing? I'm still waking up, so I wasn't able to one-hit him. But that's okay. So let's remove the glass here. Anybody in here? I guess it was that, that sneaky boy. That sneaky boy. Made his way all the way through this hotel room. Wow, he's determined. He is fucking determined. Alright, I'm gonna close these curtains for now, I guess. Just so nobody can peek through and see what I'm doing on the other side. Hmm, do I have my saw? I assume I have my saw, right? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, a little bit of building is probably what I want to get up to today. Uh, but then the question becomes... Which way? Which way do I make the things? Hmm. Yes, indeed. I suppose uh, it would be nice to just kind of start uh, here and build a cross and make a little door, and then I can board up basically everything else here, I do think. As long as, yeah. As long as the nails will go into the glass without shattering the glass, I think we should be relatively fine. So, let's see. We've got, uh, door frames. We've got walls. Wall? Frame. I guess, I guess we can't just make a wall. we got to start with a frame. That's different. But okay. Make it happen. Make it happen, Cap'n. You keep it all nice and lined up. Just how it's supposed to be. Excellent. That's going well. Um, hmm, so how do I put a fucking, a covering on this wall? There is my question, yes, yes. Maybe I don't have enough wood to do it quite yet. Well, that's fine. I'll make this right here, and then I'll put a door frame in, see if we can't figure that out. I don't want to do just, uh all building this episode, because those episodes get a little bit boring. We still got a little bit more of this town to get figured out and stuff like that. And also, uh, I'm, I'm quite sleepy. I'm going to get quite sleepy at some point. So, wooden door. we got the door frame. That's what I want. Put it here. Please and thank you. Excellent. And... 
that use four planks. I don't think I'm going to be able to do much with two planks, so we got to chop down some more trees. Some more trees! Please, the trees! Alright, give me my axe. I want to equip the axe. And then I can just uh, level this entire forest, I guess. I don't know, I guess! It's always kind of slow going in Project Zomboid, but... That's, uh, that's part of it. If you were in the, uh, Zombocalypse, then you probably gotta take a lot of time to build a base and whatnot. Things don't just happen overnight, okay? We ain't wizards around here. I mean, if I was, this would be a lot easier. But we ain't. So cry me a river. Cry me a river, Mr. Wizard. You ever watch that Mr. Wizard show? I remember waking up at, uh, like 3 a.m. when I was little. I still do this, as a matter of fact. I just fucking wake up to watch weird shows that I want to watch. Not even weird, like, pornographic-wise. Just kind of, uh, you know, I'm curious about fucking what's on the Disney Channel. Something like that. Alright, I'll pull some nails out of my bag. That's what we need to complete this wall. Is it, is it, is that done? Did, did we do it? Okay, great. So, create wooden wall level 3. We can't do that quite yet. But we can do level 2. So let us... Let us commence. And it is raining now. I fucking hate the rain. Why every time with the rain? Um... So how many planks? We need two, and we have six. Okay. That's gonna go nicely. And I'm getting a little wet now. I think I left my poncho upstairs. Didn't I? Didn't I? Ah. Fucking rain. Every time. And it's getting heavy. It's getting pretty heavy out here. I'll just kind of chill out for just a moment under this little bitty. And, um, yeah, do I have... Yeah, I have some dirty bandages here. Wow, well, I'm, I'm looking a little fucked up. Well, my hand is healed. My thigh still burned. Well, slap a bandage on that. I don't think we need to disinfect it. It looks relatively dark. Which means it's going to be healed shortly, I do presume. Um, I want to know where my fucking rain poncho went. I probably did just drop it off. Can't we just drape the tarp over ourselves? Oh, here's the rain poncho. Haha, uh -huh, I'm not crazy. I mean, I am, but not as crazy as I thought I was. Bah, 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 bah. Um, should I leave the eggs here? I don't know. I don't know. I'm so indecisive. I should just make a choice and stick with it. Alright. Do a little more chopping. We're gonna be fine. We just need to take a little break and dry off once in a while. Um, so pick these logs up. Can we do that? I know it's a lot, but just, just, we're not gonna break our back, right? Can't take much more! Movement compromise! Oh shit! That's fine. And we're back under cover. See? See how easy that is? Much easier than fucking taking the whole thing. I can make a Christmas tree? Oh my god. Probably need to do that. If we're gonna be over here for Christmas, we need to make a Christmas tree. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Wooden door. Here we go. Doopy doop. Shoopa doopa doo. And I don't think I need to make, like, a little airlock here. It might be kind of cool. But, uh, a little bit unnecessary. If one were to ask me. So, okay. This baseball bat. I don't think we need the axe for now. We got plenty of planks, and I took, uh, some wood crates as well. That I can break down. Ooh, somebody broke into that place over there. But, priorities. Priorities, priorities. Let's, uh, board up the, the front over here, if I'm able to do that. Is this the way through? Yeah. It is. I didn't lose my mind quite yet. We're gonna need a lot of fucking planks to do this. Four, eight, twelve. Just for this one side. Hmm. I'm not gonna like that too much. But oh well. We 
got to do what we got to do. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey. Oh, and it is raining so hard out there. Why is it raining so hard? Um, can we just throw this hiking bag on the ground for a minute? That'll help me. And, uh, secondary doctor's bag. We have a little dig around in here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And uh, I'm not finding what I wanted. Where are those fucking wood crates? Help me, help me. Did I not take them? Or did I just shove them in my inventory? I guess I didn't take them. God damn it, Brain. I really wanted you to do the right thing. But you just didn't. You just didn't. You just couldn't, could you? Alright. Well, I guess we could chop some more trees. I'll save them planks for a little later. <clears throat> and, uh, I'm a little loath to leave this door. I mean, it is a big glass door. If I just put a sheet over it, things might be okay. But also, hmm, could get a little bit dangerous as well. Alright, grab them logs up. Load it up, boy. We got work to do. Heck yeah! My axe is about to break as well. Probably need to rustle up some wood glue. Did I find some wood glue around here? Can't rightly recall. But it's so nice to uh, work inside the comfort of this, this home. Or office. Or indoors, I guess is what I mean to say. Wonderful! So now let's barricade more windows. It is a shit ton of, uh, of windows to board up. But if you just keep at it, then uh, it goes relatively quick, I guess. Oops, standing in darkness. That's okay. Everything's okay here. And then we can do one and a half more windows as we chop down another tree. That seems to be a good plan. Back into the rain. I'll probably equip my axe. Gonna take me a long time to knock this shit down with a hammer. Ba -boop, ba -boop. Come on. There you go. That's right. And I think we can fit up to 50 pounds. As long as I don't mind moving like a snail. So it's not too bad. We'll just slowly make our way over. There we go. I'll chop up them logs. Uh huh. So many fucking windows. But, uh, that's a security hazard. You see? You can't have it be like that. Zombies, they'll just hop in any old which way. Any which way they can get it. And I am a little bit thirsty, so I'm gonna visit that, uh, that water cooler behind me. Get the, the fresh, delicious water. I'm the water boy. Alright, go do this one now. I think that's all I could fit on that window, yeah. The option is to unbarricade now, which I definitely don't want to do. So, okay. Good jab, good jab. Still quite overweighted. Let's fill this bottle. And get a little drinky drink. Uh, did I drink from the water bottle first? I guess I did. What a dick. What a dickhead. And now I'm chilly, so I need to wear my dirty, bloody sweater. Bloody sweater. And... Oh, damn. Seems like I have just, just too much weight. I don't understand. I guess it's the doctor's bag. Doctor's bag has quite a bit in it. And that takes me down to fairly heavy. But that's still fairly heavy. I'm not going to be able to stay here forever. Unless I, unless I decide to, but, um, I'm gonna miss all the other shit. Especially the tea party. I went and I set up a tea party and I'm just gonna abandon that shit? Nah. Not today, bruh. There's a log. I was hoping it would give me two. I don't know why it doesn't. Give me this one. Hey, Mr. Zombie. You having a good time? Me too. I am a lumberjack and I'm okay. I worked all night and I sleep all day. Oh god. Oh god. Oh fuck. Okay, please lay down. Please lay down. 
Fuck, I can't even run away. I'm too weighted down. Jesus Christ. Ugh! Wow, that was uh, a tense moment. This is probably not the best idea that I've had. I could have just, like, killed him before I started chopping the tree. But that's no fun. We're out here to have the funsies, aren't we? Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Bob. All right, a few more logs. Chop them up. Chop them up. Make it happen. And then uh, I should be able to do three more windows. Maybe. Two and, yeah. It's going to be nine planks. So I can finish out this one, slap a plank on this one. Jesus, please us. Is my carpentry leveled, at least? Hell yeah, it is. Bam. Look at that shit. I'm an expert. Expert carpenter. Mmm, wonderful day. I kind of want to take a nap on one of these couches, but that's not a smart plan. Don't do it until you have the place entirely sealed up. One broken window? I mean, I'll probably wake up from the broken window, but I just don't want to fucking experience all that. <laughs> that trauma. To my little brain. To my poor little brain. Okay. Throw this axe away for now. Got 11 nails left. I think that's a... That's a good amount of work for today, isn't it? We did just fine. Ah. That'll do. That'll do. I should probably actually, um... Go back on through and get those wood crates. Get the wood crates, then we'll call it for the day. And I've also got high exertion. Can barely run. Well, he seems to be doing okay. Maybe it's because of that sprinting skill. I got so much skills in sprinting. Check me out. Can we go for a little sleepy sleep? Are you sure you want to sleep? Yeah. I had a long morning. Dang. Okay, wake up. It's noon now. Wake up. There you go. Good boy. Good boy! I got so many Molotovs. Wooden crates, that's what I want. I can do a couple more windows with these. And, um, I don't have anything to eat. Shit. Therein lies the problem. Oh, well, we can open some canned beans. Mmm, canned beans. Wonderful. Let's go ahead and eat that up. Nom nom nom. I like beans. I like beans. I like fruit. Fruits are the beans of the fruitness. What? Are, are you making words right now? I'm trying. <laughs> I'm really trying. I'm failing miserably. Well, at least the uh, the rain is done for now. <clears throat> We've got our little, uh, little first section of wall completed. There's a lot more to go, though. God damn. <clears throat> Where to put that plank? Get over here, plank! Ain't no time to be just laying around. All willy-nilly. So two per. It's gonna give me seven. Dang. Thought we could uh, complete something else, but... Apparently not. We're gonna do uh, one and three quarters windows. But that's good. We did uh, a good amount of work on this bit here. Yeah, I, I feel good about that today. Wonderfully done. And carpentry. Leveled. Leveled! I could also probably upgrade those walls since it said, hey, you need a uh, level 7 carpentry. Well, guess what, bitch? I got it. I got it now. Upgrade. We need one plank. So if I got like three... Three planks... Then I could upgrade those. Okay, I'll just do that. I'll just do that real quick. And also bash this bitch in the face! Mm. The fuck down! Yeah! That's what I do. That's what I do now. How you liking that shit, huh? Huh? Oh, where's my doctor's bag? Why do I keep unequipping this? I don't understand. I just, I just a little more work. Just a little more work. I'm like, oh, we're totally not going to work the whole day long. 
Well, guess what? We've been uh, we've been at this shit for like twelve hours, just about, and uh, it ain't pretty. Let's saw some of these up, just one, and then I get some planks, and then I, I finish my my business. Just mind your business, mind your business. That's uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Anybody? I wasn't up. Aware of it when it was running, but now that it's on Nick at night, okay, sure. Sure, we like that. That. Oh, it is the best wall in the land. Look at that. We're patching up our, our shit, shit job. Making it look nice. Ah, I could be proud of that. Wonderful, wonderful. All right. Axe goes away. Can opener probably goes away. Uh, I don't need my compass at the moment either. So let's stuff that in a bag. I'm just trying to keep myself a little bit underweight. This is a hard thing. Mm, disassemble. Scrappable object. No, no, no. I don't want to do that. How do I upgrade the door frame? God damn it. Whatever. I don't have time for this shit. I gotta get on the road. Been to all these shops down here for the most part. From what I can recall, I'm hoping that we'll find something uh, a bit more interesting down the way. Here's the pharma hug. Hmm. Sheba Jewelers. Mama McFudgingtons. Fudruckers. And L Lola Lemon. Lulu Lemon. Most disgusting workout pants in existence. Mostly worn by fat girls, uh, from my experience. <laughs> I gotta talk about that no more, though. I'm tired of talking about Lulu Lemon pants. I've already revealed that I know a bit too much about that. That fashion trend that is no longer trendy. Who wears them shits anymore? That was like a month. A month long, and then people were like, Wow, you know what? These are kind of garbage. Yeah. You figured that out all by yourself? Good job. I'm still collecting money. Still collecting keys. Still collecting money for the key club. If anybody wants to donate, we've uh, got a, a children's softball league starting up next year. Uh, not that there are any children left. They're mostly zombies, but you go out there with a bat and you just have a good old time. Good God. My exertion's peaking up a little bit. I'll need to watch that. Uh, got some nails. Step, step away. Sir, please step away. This is your last warning. Alright. You, you forced me to do this. I have to physically restrain you. You see? You think this is what I want to do? What the fuck is this? This is gonna be amazing. It's such a big building. So much possibility. Oh, well. Hmm, cabbage seeds and candles. I don't need any of this. I forgot my fucking trowel. Why? Hmm. I should be keeping an eye out for that, I suppose. I can't plant shit. I don't have a trowel. I don't have a watering can. But honestly, bringing all that shit up here, uh. Yeah. Would have been more trouble than it's worth, I do think. And uh, we don't need garbage bags because I've got a pool as my garbage collector. Or my rain collector. <sighs> well, it is garbage rain. You know what I'm talking about? There's a little bit of pop and orange soda. Hmm. Do I need this stuff? Yeah, I guess I do. I was noting how I was out of food earlier, so we'll just take it. Just take it. That's fine. Who loves orange soda? I don't know. I don't know anybody that loves orange soda. What are you talking about, sir? Well, this is the the reading room for the children. This is this is fun for the children. Oh, look at this! You can learn so much. Gold working. Oh, I heard a window break. That's not good. The zombies are scared of the rain too. Well, I suppose uh, I should keep an eye out for that fella. This is like a big uh, meeting area, recreation room, something like that. 
They use it to hold the booster club meetings. Oh, this is fun for the children. Right here. Could be fun for the dating too. Cat toy, no. Doll, no. Spiffo. Spiffo! He's spiffy. Damn, we got Spiffo. Hell yeah. That's ultra rare. Oh, dude. More people breaking in? So let's check all of this. Yeah, we're good. We're good. But I got a Spiffo. That's the best part. I'm gonna collect all the Spiffos that I can. I'm kind of scared to go down there. I hear a lot of bumping and banging. Bumping and grinding. I see you whining and grinding up on that pole. I see you looking at me and you already know I wanna fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you! <laughs> yeah! Got him, coach! Energy bar. Energy bar. Candy bars. Well, there's a big room here. A big room of something. God, they're just fucking everywhere. Why are they always making trouble? You know, couldn't we just have a nice time? Oh, it's the locker room. So people go to take their pants off. Oh, it's the ladies' locker room, too. They got some tampoons. A, pe a box of menstrual pad and a box of tampoons. And there's an MRE for some reason. Whatever, I take that. Gibbs me that. I want it for free, I said gibbs me that. Uh, get this sweater off of me. That kind of rhymes. <laughs> Comic book. Everybody likes that. I gotta pay a little more attention to what I'm looking at in here. Thumbtack? What the fuck? What do you think I need this for, huh? That ain't a thing. Hey, back the fuck up! Lay down! Hundred dollar bill, y'all! And a key. And also a penny, but fuck that. I'm rich, bitch! I'm rich, bitch! She was in the men's locker room. Unless maybe these... Oh, they got some menstrual pads in here, too. Well, maybe somebody's uh, holding tampoons for their, their girlfriend or something. Which you should do, you know? You want to be a, a good husband, boyfriend, wife... Not wife. <laughs> uh, then, yeah, it's just hold on to that tampon. I'd go and buy my wife uh, menstrual pads if she needs it. I don't give a fuck. Oh, whiffle ball bat. Whiffle ball bat! I'm not gonna pick it up. That's fine. So was that, was that it? It was just a couple of lockers? A couple of locker rooms? That's not even fun. It's gotta be like the YMCA or something. I, I assume... Oh god. Bitch almost snuck me. Almost. Hmm, got some wood glue. Yes. This is what I was wishing for. Indeed. Another wooden crate I will take. That'll be useful. Hmm, golf club. Num 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 num. Screwdriver. Do I need a screwdriver? I thought I needed a screwdriver to disassemble that door. I guess that's a good idea. Let's repair this shit with the wood glue. Oh, we don't have enough wood glue! I need two of them? That's ridiculous. Bro, that's just, that's just ridiculous. Oh, it's raining again. Oh, damn. God damn this rain. Hey, bro. What you doing? You don't live here? They're just everywhere. Breaking in at every point that they can. Bunch of hoodlums! Bunch of hoodlums is what they are! Oh god, fuck shit. Wow. I'm pretty sure I just got bitten or scratched or something. That was... that was bad. Okay. She tried. She ain't strong enough. Ain't strong enough to hold this dating to us back? Mm, lots of baking pans. Do we got some butter? If we have some butter... Then we could make a, a fried egg, huh? Create stir fry? No, I just I want to find some butter. Maybe we can make something delicious. I 
I see that guy over there. He looking at me funny. You looking at me funny. What you looking at me funny for? Think you funny, boy? Jesus. They tore this place apart pretty good, huh? Fart, fart, fart. And this doorknob is too heavy to fit in my bag. No, we're good. Hmm. Well, I don't see any butter, so I throw the frying pan in the trash. <laughs> that makes good sense to me. Got some corn beef and whatnot. I'm just gonna put these eggs in the fridge. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do with these. I could create an egg stir fry, which is basically an omelet. Or, you know, just a fried egg. You can fry an egg without butter. I mean, half of it's gonna stick in the pan, but so what? So what? These are desperate times. Calls for desperate measures. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's it for this place. I didn't even really decipher what it is. The YMCA is what it is. Hmm. Oh boy. Not you! Not you! I need a little more wood glue. That would be a helpful thing, wouldn't it? A little wood. Wood glue. But I know not where I might find some. I could dig through the trash. Hmm. So he's useful. A bit of dumpster diving for the children? They just have such a good time. They find some milk and whatnot, and they're like, This isn't even expired! Yes, it is. <laughs> That's why they threw it out. I think they just did this for fun? For funsies? Oh, they got some uh, under construction. I can't pick up any of these pallets. That's a shame. <laughs> But hey, if you wanted to, like, build a house in here, finish their construction job, that could be a pretty sick base. Sick base, bruh. Thanks, dude. I did it myself. There's, like, a foreman's office or some such. And they've got an American flag. These boys, let me tell you, they good boys. They good boys out here. Oh, God, please don't. Please don't look at me. I'm not doing anything. Is the foreman in here? Taking a shit as always? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. We've got a, another box of menstrual pads in here. This was a very inclusive construction site. You're a woman and you want to work construction? Can you lift this 80 pound bag of cement? Okay, you can. You got the job. Congratulations. You're fulfilling our diversity requirements. <laughs> and also, you probably get catcalled on the job every day. They're like, oh, baby, look at that. She wielded that crowbar real good. I got a bar for you. Ha ha ha. That's what it sounds like. That's what it sounds like, mostly in my head. But it's probably not far from uh, the truth. I don't know if there's anything down that way, so I'm just going to uh, try and get behind this here fence. This looks like a fancy house over here, doesn't it? Look at this. Look at this here. Huh. Wow. Look at that brick, uh, brick front. That's so nice. Riverside is just so fancy. Fancy pants, huh? Chances are your pants are not as fancy as the pair of very fancy pants that Mr. Fancy Pants would wear. When everybody's marching in the Fancy Pants Parade, he's gonna be the best. He's gonna pass the test. Uh, we can fit this box of MREs. Should have put this fucking shotgun down. It's a semi-automatic shotgun, which makes it cool. You want to be cool, don't you kids? It's almost time for bed anyhow. Maybe I should just hang out in here for the night. Turn this fucking TV off. Oh, it's off already. Something's turned on. Who's knocking? Who's that knocking at my window? Fuck. You're freaking me out. Whoever it is, you're freaking me out. Alright, 
Are we good? Jesus. Maybe they're knocking next door. But it sure does sound close, doesn't it? Hmm. Oh, look at this. A study. Very nice. Everyone likes a study, don't they? Maha! Music, master first aid. I don't need any of this. I would learn to play some music, but instead I disassemble every piano I come across. Why? Because I'm sad I can't play music no more. Where's the nails? Put them in here? I guess so. And the window has broken, so... Please be careful. Shut this fucking door. There's even more books. You got a fucking algebra textbook? Wow, these kids. These kids nowadays, they super smart. They super smart. Anybody in here? I'm just looking for some wood glue. Please give to me some wood glue. Um, can't fit this jar with the lid anywhere. I've got too much shit. Just far too much crap to carry around these days. Hmm, I should probably turn this off. Okay, it says set alarm, so I'm going to assume that that alarm clock is turned off already. And then they have a couple of action figures. I've got action figures as well, but are they similar is the question. Yes, they're, they're exactly the same. So, uh, let's put those back. We got some of them already. Toy Monkey, Toy Panda, I know we've got those already. We got a monkey and the panda is with us currently. But it couldn't hurt. Oh yes it could. We can't fit any of this shit. It's making me so sad. Can't bring all my friends back with me. Uh, why? Alright, we'll just carry around the saw. We can also drink the uh, the root burr. Oh my god. This is gonna get so ugly. I hear so much going on around me. I'm not liking this. Um. Fuck. The question is whether to barricade the door or not. I suppose not. It's whatever. We're gonna be fine. I'm gonna lay down for the night. Cross your fingers for me, friends. This might go terribly. Close the curtains, close the door. Everything's gonna be fine. We'll sleep tight. Don't let the, the bed zombie bugs bite. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching, friends. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. This has been Project Zomboid. Uh, we'll find a new weapon, make our way back in the next episode. There's quite a bit of Riverside left to explore, so we'll do that. A little bit more building, stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Have a good old time. Anyways, <laughs> I do appreciate your patronage so very much. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy. We've also got Discord links, uh, Patreon links, Twitter links. If you want to reach out to me on any of those, that would be greatly appreciated. Once more, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I shall see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you my friend